ladies and gentlemen, Dirk Arthur. Hi, this is Chuck Rounds with Las Vegas Internet Television, LVITV.com, and we're here today with the star of Extreme Magic, Mr. Dirk Arthur. Dirk, it's great to see you. Thank you, and thanks for having us. You're very welcome. And you have a wonderful show here at the Tropicana in the Tiffany showroom, by the way. How did you get started in magic? Well, you know, I think like a lot of magicians, when I was a little kid, I got a magic set, and it was sort of an obsession. You know, most magicians start out kind of introverted, and uh, something they can do and, and feel good about doing. And one thing really led to another. Uh, I turned the hobby into a profession and kept adding and adding, and here I am in Las Vegas at the Tropicana. How old are you? 12 years old. I was a little younger than that when I started doing magic, but that's pretty cool. The reason I mention it, today, Nathan, I'm going to have you perform magic for all these nice people because this is the best audience I have ever had. Well, your show has a little bit of everything. You have the dancers, of course, the wonderful magic, and the big cats. When did you start incorporating the animals into your act, and uh, how did you get started with all that? Well, you know, I started with, uh, with a bird act uh, originally, with uh, pigeons and doves and that sort of thing, and I gradually expanded that to have huge birds like ostriches and emus. And, uh, but finally, around that time, Siegfried and Roy were getting really popular, and I couldn't book my act with the emus and the ostriches. People were like, well, you know, why does he have these strange birds? So I finally decided, oh, if I couldn't beat Siegfried and Roy, I'd at least, you know, try to beat him at their own game. That's what got me into the cats. Uh, and it's been uh, many, many, many years now working with the big cats. And uh, we have, actually have the largest collection of rare cats in any show right now. So we're really excited about that. You have the uh, regular tigers, you have the white tigers, uh, you also have a liger? Uh, no, we don't have the liger, but we have uh, the pure, th you're thinking of uh, snow magic, because yes. he kind of looks like a lion, but he's actually a pure white tiger, but of course without having the stripes, he kind of, he has that kind of lion face, uh, so we have snow magic, we have black panthers, and a beautiful spotted leopard in the show as well. Well, it is just wonderful. Now, you've been a staple here in Vegas for a long time. You started in Jubilee. Correct, yeah. And uh, then went to the Silverton for a while. Right. And then you went downtown. Mm -hmm. And finally, you landed here. How is the Tropicana, having seen most of Las Vegas? I actually love the Tropicana. I love working with everybody here at the Trop. I'm not just saying that because I'm here. But uh, the stage is actually absolutely beautiful perfect for magic. It's just a great size. There's plenty of space for all the big illusions, you know, all of my large effects, the helicopter, the train, and of course all the animals. So I love that great lighting here. And it is a beautiful classic showroom, of course, home of the Follies Berger in the evenings. And as you know, we work in the daytime, so it's really fun sharing the room uh, with the Follies. Well, do you like having the show in the afternoon, keeping your evenings free? You know, I like it. I mean, it's a lot of fun. And of course, I normally work at nights. I mean, I think some performers feel there's a stigma to like, oh, it's just an afternoon show. But really, I'm doing the same type of show that I would be doing if it was in the evening. So to me, it's just a, you know, just a time. And the good thing about the afternoon and being a magic show is we can have a lot of kids come, and I really like that. Yes. Now, eventually, we know that the Tropicana may be imploded. Uh, they've been putting that off for a little while now. But what happens when the Tropicana goes away for a little while? Well, um, you know, I love working in Vegas, and I live here now. I'm a, I'm a, a local, so I'm sure I'll just continue working.
Uh, we are all just uh, enjoying working here, and uh, as I said, nothing's definite yet, so uh, we're just enjoying working at the Trop. Well, it's a great show. Extreme Magic in the Afternoons at the Tiffany Showroom at the Tropicana Hotel. Thank you, Mr. Arthur. Thanks, Chuck. Thanks for having I me. I appreciate it's it. My pleasure. Good to see you. It's good to see you. This is Chuck Rounds with Las Vegas Internet Television, LVITV.com. You are watching Las Vegas Internet Television. LVITV.com